Ricicle here. Haven't made a video in a while, but uh, I don't know if this is going to be my last knife unboxing because I stopped collecting knives because I had the Alpha Beast and that was like the holy grail of my knives. Like, yes, once I have that, never need any other knife because it's fun to play with. Also, strongest locking mechanism, so I beat the hell out of it while I still had it. Then USPS lost it. Long story short, friend had to ship it to me. USPS lost it, so I'm like, damn. And I just played with other knives, but then I fell in love with the uh, B200, I think. I have to do another review because this is, it's not as I expected. The long-term run is different. But yes, um, no, I thought I'd like that, but now getting a better one. So, let's see what's in here. Oh, paperwork, blade HQ, bubble wrap, always fun to play with, Microtech, what? And then just a fire starter because I was missing one in my bug out bag. Well, let's just have fun looking at this first. I don't know what this is like. I just saw the cheapest one and I'm like, ah, I'll take that. Ah, that's pretty cool. Nice, comes with a little striker. That's awesome. I'll keep that. Shred. Cool. And the Microtech. Aw, yeah. Let's just see what that is. And I'll open it. Oh yeah, you push it. I'm like, oh, this is such a tight fit. Sorry, such a bad camera angle. So you got the uh, maintenance, and then some of that. Cool, got some signature on it. Got the container. Oh, I thought it has a sheath comes with it. Nah. Oh well. It's a nice little sleeve. Microtech. Ah, oh, here it is. Metal mark. Oh, that's just... I'm a little cautious with this. It's nice and sharp. Let's see. A little cut test. Oh, yeah. Pretty sharp. I like it. Ugh, I'm scared. That's an odd. Oh, that's why. So it's a little stiff. I think I'll break it in. Ah. But yeah, so far, I like it. First impressions. Nice and tough. I like the spring latch. Yeah, you have to squeeze it in there pretty tight. It's a pretty cool metal mark. See all the specs there. The focus. That's pretty cool. It tells you the date when it's made. Yeah, pretty cool. I like it. I like the uh, green handles. Add a little color to my gear. And I'm going to see if I can... I like the hardware. And I... Uh, carry it because I usually have the uh, pocket clip on my Alpha or B200. Let's see if I can use this lanyard of mine. Fits. So perfect. Got a little lanyard. Matches colors too. Woohoo! Oh man, I got it. Huh. That's cool. So, hopefully you'll see my review on this pretty soon. So far, loving the knife. I think I gotta break it in still. Uh. Yeah, definitely need to break it in. But on the bright side, I have a much more fun knife to play with now. And it's interesting, it only has one tang pin. 
only has one tank pin. Uh, I think it has a kicker. I think that's the kicker. So it doesn't hit the uh, actual blade inside the handles. Yeah, I don't know if you can see that. Well, yeah, I like how you can see the uh, sp spring latch. I like that. Handles feel nice and smooth. I like it. Alright. Till next time. Peace. Do the uh, first impressions. So I've been carrying it for about a day now. And because it has no latch or no clip, I just used that little lanyard I made. Some paracord. Some thin wire. Not wire, but it's thin, thin cordage. And then like little... Uh, valve caps for bicycles or cars and I just drill the hole right through them and I like that spring latch love that spring latch and I like it first impression I love the how tough that tip is look at that it has a swedge on there you see that it's thick and then it tapers and it goes back out so it's nice and Love it. Looks tough. So, I know I'm going to be having fun with that. Here's what I hate about it. And this is what really makes me sad that I can't flip it. Yeah, it's stuck like that. So, I, I've been waiting to get it broken in, but can't really, can't really flip like this. And if you're going to pay full price for this, I'm sure that would piss you off a lot. Especially if you got it 2012 when it was first came out or something. It was like 400 bucks. I think it's lowered. It's lowered now, definitely. Because I've seen some old video to YouTube videos and they said, like, oh, it's 400 bucks. But now it's only like 160 I think. And even if I paid full price, I'd be so mad. Those marks you see right there, those are from the tang pins. Or tang pin, singular. Because it doesn't fit right. It's a little off by like a millimeter and then when it gets in there it gets stuck so I hate that that's a pain in the butt I have to go uh, file that down before I can even start flipping I can't even flip this open but then when I close it that happens so that's never a plus yeah I can't even feels odd the handles it's very I saw some people flipping it on, on video, and I don't know how they did it, because it's really uh, difficult to hold on to that part curves up, but it's really comfortable, so I'm going to use this as a everyday carry, and I'm loving it so far. Really love the shape, the little belly, and the recurve in there, and it goes out. Oh, beautiful. Super sharp. Um, I like it. I love the detail on the little latch. And those uh, special Microtech screws it does suck that you can't. Yeah, security screws too, so you can't really tamper with it. I think they um they put Loctite on there for you, so that's good. But I wanted to make that video, make this video, showing that that sucks. I can't even flip it out of the box, and I'm sure that would piss off anyone else. Balance is completely horrible because of that. So I'm gonna try and uh file that down so it, it the tang pin actually matches up with it because here's the cup and here's the pin it doesn't go in perfectly like that it comes off a little to the side so when it the other handle comes in to squish it it kind of like smashes this and makes it odd so, I mean, so it's not really just boom in and out it gets stuck and then the other handle comes in and then you squeeze it and it gets really jammed in there and then it, it's, it gets stuck. So that's a pain. And I'm going to file that down. And you shouldn't, for something you paid for, especially over 100 bucks. and if you bought it new, like, when it first came out, I'd be pissed. I'm like, I have to file this down before I can flip it? Oh, come on, Microtech. I'm sure this is just, like, one mess up, but... <sighs> Bear Ops messed up with my knife. This thing messing up, I just have bad luck. USPS lost my Alpha Beast. So, yeah. 
first impressions. I like it. I love the, that. It's really nice feel in your hands. It's just so smooth overall. I love the curvature, but I don't know how that will play into flipping because I can't flip this yet. Very depressing. So I'm going to file that down and uh, see if that works or does anything. So, uh, peace, guys. P.S. I filed it. I filed it, so... You see that gray or shiny part right there? If it focuses. That won't focus. But yeah, it. I don't know if you see that glistening right there. Those silver parts, I had to file that with my Leatherman file. So now, it, aw, oh, damn it. I guess I have to file a little more. But it worked for the most part. So it doesn't stick as much. Aw, oh, damn it. All right. But, yeah, I think a little more filing and it'll work. So, almost there. It still sucks. You have to file it. Darn. Oh, well. Life continues. Peace out, guys. Use two different files. Just BS. Leatherman file. And then a rounded file. So I can get real. It's rounded, you know, so. It's rounded file for rounded filing. And that didn't work. It worked for the most part, but it still stuck once in a while. If I flipped it really hard, it would get stuck. So, love that spring latch. Like I slam it real hard, it would get stuck. But now, not anymore. Perfect. Not because I filed it. Because I put wax. Yeah, that... Interesting. So yeah, I fixed it with wax instead of filing down. You can see how much I filed down. Um, quite a bit, actually. So... Not enough to notice it, but enough to notice it. <laughs> Damn it all, Microtech. Well, at least the problem's gone, and now I have a knife again. So finally I can start flipping it and um, have some fun with it. Uh, I want to see how it flips, because it is curved handle, so I think that'll make it a lot more challenging than necessary. But yeah, finally done with this video. Because I'm finally able to flip it. Woohoo. Peace out, guys. Again.